Hello YouTube, this is Omerton here with another episode of Wargame Airland Battle. So today the 360 guards continue to fight the DBL. French are a bit down on morale and crucially initiative, they're running quite low. And we've got another battle group that's going to be coming in to reinforce. So that's all well and good. So we're going to start off by buying our usual collectionist command vehicles to uh, bring up the rear. Armoured command vehicle here. Now that uh, Elena has been neutralised, we can uh, move up our ATGM defence again, which is lovely. But we are going to buy in our motor strategy. We are going to buy in. It's too risky for him. He's, there's PT 76 there's should still provide adequate defences. I'm going to call in a buck and give it an FOB to keep itself running. I don't think Carton is valuable enough to warrant a command vehicle at this point. Let's see. Recon. I think we still have our Conquerors. Yes, we do. And we will buy in some Motor Strelgy. There's four. Four here. I'm also going to deploy. Don't have enough for another FOB. So we'll just buy some and some. We'll buy in some supply trucks. In as soon as a support, we will be calling in some Stralitans here, another Stralitan here, more infantry, and I'll buy in some recon when we can afford it. So the plan is the Buck and this group of infantry and recon vehicles will hold Carton by shooting them as they cross the bridge, should be a killing zone, and these forces will hold Elena. I'm going to invest in defending. Or, well, they won't hold the lane, they'll hold Malin. I'll be investing in buffing up the defense of Malin because I think Carton is well and truly defended. Let's see, so. Of course, the AGGMs will be having a field day, of course, from the start. Rain it down. If you can kill that command vehicle right from the start, that would be lovely. There we go. And, uh, yes, guess keep uh, firing your AGGMs. I'm going to make sure these guys are well and truly supplied because there's a lot of units here that we can kill from the start. Right, command vehicles moving in. Let's unload these guys, put them in the safety of the town and get the BMPs to kill this command vehicle. Same with you guys. Infantry, I don't, you know, I don't really need them, I just want the BMPs that it comes in. Right, let's knock out this command vehicle and let's get this uh, asshole out of the way. That lovely. Maybe a few easy games wasted, but uh, he's going to complain. Let's buy in some, some more supply vehicles. This is sort of a chain effect where the FOB will be supplying the supply vehicles, which will be supplying the uh, frontline units. It allows you to keep your FOB further back to allow it to supply rear units like the Buck, but still have a constant stream of supplies going to the uh, frontline units. It's quite a nice tactic. Let's see, speaking of tactics, let's uh, get an MI2, start scouting. We've killed a lot of points. Of, we haven't even taken a casualty yet, look at that. Let's advance the BMPs right to the edge. If we can pick off these uh, keep little VABs, it's not much, but it's something. So this is uh, going to get you to go around here. Going to buff up our uh, anti aircraft defense with this little guy here. Just in case they get a bit too offensive. Right, looks like a charge is coming in. Swarm tactics. Let's get the motor strike keep prepared to ambush. Of course now they may they might not have any easy gems left, but the BMP still have a good cannon. Never forget that. Right, let's get you to stop so you can uh, start the supply. Of course, we're going to take hits here because they've brought in these uh, Vam Heastros. Okay, you should be on resupply radius for a lot of things now. Nope. Okay. Oh, well, they've brought in mortars. Let's let's see. Let's start off by uh, getting a little uh, SU-24. Let's knock out those mortars. Let's start getting our uh, forces on. SU-24 is coming from the wrong direction, of course. It's going to pass over any anti-aircraft defense they have. Let's 
Let's see, let's make you get more passes. You can start focusing on those tanks. The tanks are a worry. Wow, these are... Oh yeah, but of course, if you take fire, you don't get resupplied. Should you know that? Let's see, air corridor... Right, that MIT is going to get swatted if it's spotted. Or if they have enough forces to deal with it, of course. Assuming that. CBMPs are taking too much fire. They can't do. They can't. Uh, let's buy in some tanks. BMB two cannons are good and should work quite well against the keep French armor. Well, I don't say keep French armor. I mean weak French armor. French tanks that don't have uh, good armor. All right, there's a good supply of FOB trucks there. So a few. The odd artillery shell will then go amiss. Right, they're buying in units here. We really start investing in some artillery. What do we got? The Amaskas? I want something with good accuracy. Don't have any of that though. Oh, we're using supply trucks because these guys are taking too long to aim because they've taken all this morale damage, but tax over, we can get the supply. Let's see, that's why I had a little uh, MI24. Let's go. With... I was going to buy an AR, our last BM21 grad. The attack started over here. Looks like the Conquerors and the BMP should be able to handle their own SG24. Let's get those Valve Mahistros out of here. Grads up here, ready to fire. I am going to get it to target. This if let's just let's just knock this offensive out of any out of the realms of possibility. Okay, mistrials are up. You should get out of there. You're taking a hit. One more hit and you'll be killed. And you're evacuating over them. That's smart. Okay, what do we have? What do we have? okay you might as well stop and get some killing done with these VABs. Uh, I can't find the CV. It's probably hidden in the town somewhere. These guys are still shaking, so I don't want to start an attack with them just yet. Migs have been running, so let's might as well knock out their, uh, see, their uh, little tank hunters. Knock out the AA. Could not a big sort of deluge swarm attack. Just keep binding in these guys. Our eating games are working very well. Right, that AML should be finished off soon. I'm just going to deluge infantry into this area and try and capture it. And I'm pretty sure either this uh, urban area or this forest is where their, CV, their, their last CV is. Of course, they probably have tons of CVs. Being the AI, they always buy it more than they want. It makes hunting for them very annoying. But, uh, alright, let's get the tank to advance. Get some uh, attacks done. Okay, that's CV, or that, I keep calling it a CV, that recon vehicle spotted us, let's stop, take it out, volley of AT game fire, oh there we go, so total victory, I guess I was just, we just killed enough stuff, we didn't even need the CV, well well, hopefully that finishes off the battle group, if not it's definitely routed, yeah that looks like a route circle if I look, third commando brigade has been destroyed, that, wait what? I can't even remember where the third command. Oh yeah, of course down here, south of uh, Stockholm. USS Enterprise has arrived in the North Sea, forming the nucleus. Okay, so there you go. Capture Munich. Okay, so let's see what do we have. Advance towards the Rhine. NATO will use a nuclear strike if they have one, and two air raids and two commander raids. That seems nice. Redeploy. We get more special forces, more airstrikes, more air cobbles, and more recon. I think advance towards the Rhine. Just because, obviously, if NATO has a nuclear strike, that will suck if they use it against us. And I think that'll do well. But again, there's the, well, that's the end of day four. That was a quick day fighting. Uh, but yeah, this has been all major. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the battle. And goodbye.